Hello, my name is Doug. Today I'm going to talk about some issues around sustainability and other green concerns. This is the first part of a documentary that is going to explore electric cars in some detail. In cities, I think you start to see villagisation of suburbs, where you start to see um, more and more um, uh, you know, services and, and, and shopping in, in the villages again, and, 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 and they'll start to form nodes connected by public transport too. So there'll be less this reliance, and I, I, I don't see a future for um, shopping centres and malls that rely on people coming a long distance via you know, the, the car. I'm not saying that they won't exist, I just see them as becoming less dominant. There will be hopefully um, a, a broad uh, transport uh, network based around uh, rail. Um, you know, um, biofuels will be a, a major source of energy for production. Um, you know, uh, biodiesel especially will be used for things like driving tractors and um, although I would imagine because of cost the, the tractors will be used very judiciously and, 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 you know, um, and they won't be just, there will be a lot more um, demand for labour. Uh, I, I would argue that, that the last hundred years the society is, a, a, if you're going to call it any sort of society in historical terms, I would say we were the petroleum society. Um, we use it to fund our, fuel our transport. We use it to, uh, we convert it into fertilizers to make it grow our food, um, increase our production, and we use it uh, in producing things like this, the plastics in this machine. And uh, there's increasing evidence that um, even the International Energy Agency is now starting to allude to it in some degree, that the sort of the, uh, the production that you would require to continue to meet demand, especially with growing demand from countries like China or India, is, is not going to happen. I think there still will be, um, and there will maybe still there will still be planes flying. Um, they won't be powered by petroleum; they'll be most probably powered by some biofuel or something like that. It'll be extremely expensive. People will most probably find that. They will only fly if they really need to or they've saved up a lot and when they go, they'll go for a long time. So they won't just whip across to the UK for a wedding and fly back a week or two later, they'll go across for a month, six months or a year. Um, they may not go by um, plane, they may, but we may start to see that um, ships, you know, passenger ships starting to come back on and they will be powered by biofuels and possibly wind, sail, sails, hybrid ships. So we start to see a world that's slowing down a bit. In fact, you could argue that it's already started. Um, I, you know, the fastest passenger plane in the world was the Concorde. And um, that was built in the late 60s and came into service in the 70s and then subsequently came out of service. Never was replaced. It was never found to be cost effective. And now you've got planes like the, um, the, the Dreamliner 787, which is 20% more efficient, but it's slightly slower. We're slowing down our flight. You know, we're already in America. The the uh, they rely that traditionally they've relied on um, jet engines, uh, 737, which is the one that we use for doing their short hops. But now there's a real move towards try again to save fuel because the cost of fuel is going up, which is a reflection that's becoming scarce. They're looking at turbo props, which are you know, propeller planes, um, more efficient, less fuel consumption, slower. But they were anathema to the, the American flying public. They were seen as very much second class. But now attitudes are changing or slowly changing. Well, electric cars are, are, are cars that can that plug into the, the, the energy grid, the energy system, and get their energy from that and then store it on board in the form of a battery. There are various sorts of batteries and we can talk about the various sorts of them because that's very important. 